This is Dabu7 sharing with you our mission to the Lockwood Folly Inlet. This was a mission to find the Bendigo that you can see right here. This is a Civil War era steamer that went down in the inlet as you can see and there's not a lot known about it. So we wanted to get some up close and personal details on a recon mission to check this out and see what was going on with this because this inlet was key to our history especially the Civil War and it was just here recently where some guys in a helicopter flew over this region had seen this made mention to a brother who got down here with a drone and really got the first up close aerial shots of it and that's when we were like wow they don't know really anything about this what's still in it exactly what brought it down anything so we talked about it got together a plan to get a recon mission down in this area to at least try to find it and see what we could get and this is what we came up with this year and it's clear that during full moon low tide this thing is sticking up out of the water pretty good now this is one of several different ships that went down during the Civil War the Elizabeth is another steamer that went down here as well and there was also a third the Union warship Iron Age that were all lost in this inlet now we also had researchers discovering the remains of one of three blockade runners that was used to penetrate the wall that the Union set up down here in front of the port of Wilmington during the Civil War. So this inlet in many of the areas around here very key to our history and there's still more to be discovered out here in this inlet as I said the Elizabeth still out here and probably a whole lot more. But hopefully, on the next time around, we can get the Dive Master Mr. A in on the mission to dive this, get some more knowledge on it, and also search other regions. This has been Dabu7 sharing with you here this mission to find the Bendigo, which we did. Much love.